right, let's draw fish together. On this side, I'm going to start his mouth. It's going to be kind of open. So I'm going to have a curve, not a curve, a diagonal line, and then a smaller diagonal line. Okay, then I'm going to make the top of his body. Make sure you don't go too far because you don't have room for the tail. Instead of making the whole bottom of the body, I'm going to have to make a few steps because it's got gills and fins on the bottom. So I'm going to go over and curve up for the gills. I'm just going to go where underneath the gills and make another curve and another one. And there's the gills. can finish the body. Okay. On top of his head, or his whole body, head and body, we're going to make the fin, the big dorsal fin. And on the bottom, he's going to have multiple fins. So one comes out underneath his gills, and one comes out back here by his tail. Okay, then we're going to make the tail shape, the line that comes out, and the line that comes out. around and finish that tail. Okay, we want to add the eye. the side fin. Okay, on the mouth I'm going to kind of make a little loop and outline the top of the mouth. Okay, I want some bubbles. Now, bubbles underwater aren't those perfect circles always. So I'm going to kind of just have some bubbles coming up across the picture behind him. And they don't all have to be perfect circles. They can kind of be lumpy. Some of them can be circles, but some of them can be kind of weird shapes like this. And they can overlap like that.
there's bubbles going up behind him. When I go and color this, I'm going to put some fish in the background too that are like just colored in. So I'll show you with the pencil. There can be some kind of little shadowy, just silhouette fish. These are just going to be colored in. And they won't have that dark outline because this guy's going to stand out. He's the main fish. 